They might be in a position where for some reason your cellular data is just not working on your iPad. Now, what does this mean? Well, quite potentially, possibly if your iPad supports cell data, it may not be working. Maybe you're trying to go through somewhere and maybe the data is not working, whatever the case is. Now, the very first thing I would recommend doing is making sure that your iPad has a SIM card slot and or it has SIM card support. Not every single iPad has the ability of even using cell data. So in this case, on my iPad, I don't even have a SIM card installed on this you know, iPad, so it's not going to work. You need a SIM card installed as well as you need, an, you need to have an iPad that supports you know, cellular data. Your iPad may not even support it, so keep that in mind. Not every iPad supports it. If you verify that your iPad is a cellular version of your iPad, well, the next thing you want to do for the most part is you want to go ahead and make your way over to your settings. And all you want to do here is, again, just make sure that your iPad has a little cell data option somewhere over here. Usually it should be up here. You'll be able to see cell data or SIM card or whatever the case is. All you want to do is click on that little option and it should take you into a page which allow you to set up your cellular data. If you've already done that, then the next thing I'd recommend doing for the most part is making sure you even have cell data turned on. So you can swipe down from the top, you'll see this little option right here. All you want to do, there's going to be a little cell like antenna type of you know button that comes up, and very, very similar to how it is on iPhones, like this one right here. So just make sure that is enabled as well, and that can also probably end up fixing this situation too. So those are the main ways to do it. Now let's say that stuff still isn't working. The next thing I'd recommend doing is going through back into your iPad settings, click on software update, and seeing if there's a software update available. I would say probably every single time if there is an update available, like how there is one for me, and updating your device can probably end up fixing a lot more issues than just the cell data situation going on too. So go ahead and try updating your iPad. If that is still not working, you may want to go ahead and just contact your cell carrier. And as long as you're not in the middle of nowhere and you have cell service and everything like that and Apple servers aren't down, you may just want to contact your cell carrier and just let them know what's going on because chances are they may have an answer for you there. So that pretty much covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button. That me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly, everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully, I'll catch you guys in the next video.